right. Update on the rocket mass. We got a nice fire going in there. What it's doing is going into this hole. Goes up into a riser that's inside that barrel. That riser has a pipe coming into it that coils around, comes up, and it thermal siphons. It gets hot here, rises, and then comes over and comes down and boils into that. Sometimes it'll percolate, sometimes it'll thermal siphon. But that pipe is so hot, you don't want to touch it. This one, the hot water comes in and it fills it up enough and it flows over and it flows back down into here and it warms up this barrel. Then it goes back through the cycle all over again. Okay, what the smoke does, it rises up and through the riser. It hits a uh, clutch plate that I have on top of the riser so it don't burn up the top of my barrel. Goes back down around the outside of the barrel, goes through a hole that's right about in there, comes this way, goes under the clean out, goes down, and then it works its way back and forth before it comes over underneath them barrels and then goes up the pipe and out the house. Now these barrels are getting warmed up three ways. The heat underneath of them from the smoke, the pipes going through and thermal cycling and percolating, and then it's also got the radiation coming off of this barrel into the sides of these barrels. This barrel will get a lot hotter a lot faster than this one. But anyway, that's how we're doing. So far, it'll go about 10 hours before I have to refire it. And that's doing pretty good. Maybe it'll go for even farther once I get a third barrel up there. Who knows? We'll find out. You a bless all.